Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Um, I hope I'm alone out here. I I wanted to come out here just to have a change of scenery for this video, and um, rather than just being in my dark room. Um, so yeah, I'm just here at Caroderie, which is up the road from where I live. It's a really nice place. Um, I, I wanted to get maybe a better scene, but I couldn't because of um, I didn't want you know people hearing me. So it'd be like pretty weird to walk past me, and I was just talking about like. Yeah, I'm going for a sex change right now. Anyway, so, um, I'm now three months on tea. Um, I'm female to male, as um, you probably know by clicking on the video. Um, so I'm just going to talk about uh, kind of where I am in my um, transition and stuff. Um, so I think I'll start with the most noticeable changes um, and then work my way down. So, um, probably the first one is my voice. It's gone quite deep. It's not doing the thing where it kind of goes high pitch. Um, and I'm very glad at that because it was pretty embarrassing when you were in the middle of conversation and it suddenly jumps an octave. So, um, yeah, that's good anyway. And, sorry. Um, next of all um, is probably my facial hair. It's not very noticeable in this light, to be honest. I don't think you can really see it. Um, you can kind of see it there, like little wispy bits I'm getting. Um, I wasn't sure if those were just the normal hair you get um, on your face, but it's. I think they're getting a bit longer, they're definitely getting darker. I did have actually a bit of a moustache, but I saved it off because it was starting to look a bit musty. Um, and yeah, that's it really, the most noticeable bits. Um, emotionally and mentally, um, I'm, I'm doing quite well. I, I do have a little bit of anxiety regarding like my transition and how I'm gonna you know come out to everyone it's quite difficult because I can't hide these changes forever probably another thing that's happening is my my hair on my arms my legs and my privates are getting darker and definitely more noticeable and on my back as well my upper arms especially as well uh, so that's another change I'm quite happy about my period unfortunately has come back because I have had to go off tea for a couple of weeks because I'm, I've not been able to afford it unfortunately I'm working on that and probably by the start of February I'll be back on it so that's good anyway um other changes I can't quite think of any off the top of my head um my physical changes are definitely becoming noticeable to people they've started you know mentioning it to me and um yeah so I haven't I haven't quite come out to everyone um my family I haven't told um yet so that is something I'll have, well I have told them I'm trans but I haven't told them like I'm medically transitioning so I'll do that probably in a couple of months, I'm not too pressed about it at the minute. Um, other transition details, um, I, a surgery, I, I haven't even really thought about that because it's going to cost so much. They don't really have a proper service in Ireland um, for it, hence I had to come off tea because I'm going through privately and I've had to book blood tests and stuff. So that's kind of a barrier and um, I am saving up though in the process but I have to save up for other things at the minute um, which is quite annoying but I'm, I'm quite happy where I am right now. I'm not like I'm prepared I'm not, or sorry I'm not too prepared for anything crazy right now so I'm just taking it one day at a time. Um, that's it really. Um, I'll be back uh, for my four months on tea. Well maybe three and a half technically but yeah. Um, I also plan to go back on hormone blockers because I wasn't able to afford those. Um, so I'll let you know how it's been. It's just this week, or sorry, this month has just been a bit crazy um, for trying to source medicine for myself. So yeah, hopefully hopefully I'll get that sorted. So yeah, that's everything. Uh, thanks for watching the video. Sorry I got a bit long-winded and I kept trailing off, but I just felt it was important to include everything. Uh, just as a final note, um, please don't comment anything negative down on my videos um i i've no problem with you asking questions at all but i really do not want you posting inflammatory things about trans people or my transition it's not helpful it's not very nice especially for my mental health i'm a real person on the end of the screen and i really don't want that negative energy on my channel so please refrain from doing that um and thank you i didn't mean to end the video on a negative note but it's important to say it so yeah thank you so much for watching the video if you've gone this far and uh, take care and i'll see you the, the next day